Mwanaje wazito uh, Mt Chops okay uh, nimepata mini mob uh, kuhusu tutorials Tox mob wasio na niende nifanye tutorials where do we start uh, there are some people who asked me to do Oath of my praise let me play it and then ndakalio break the banks ni pam 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 as a drama una faikuwa na foundational drum intro so that's why nime nimesema kuna space yeah so thank you thank you thank you thank you going to ta tu ta go to pam 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 so uh, i'll just do the accents and some improvisation before the accents to make me feel of a drama in this song like uh, uh, i don't have the stems to this song but i will try uh, playing it without the song so Those are the accents. So, uh, I added some notes to to uh, before the before the accents and uh, through the accents. So it sounds like. Dun, 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 dun. Those were my thoughts. Kapata koto ke, pakata koto ke, pakata koto ke. Pam 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 pam. So ni kafkiria ni kona. Ah, prakata gudu gu, prakata gudu gu, prakata gudu gu. Pam 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 pam. So ni kajaribu. Ah, ni kasaun kitu kama. Pam 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 pam. So fasta kiasi. Yeah, I made a lot of mistakes before Nipateyo. Uh, so that's the way uh, I go about this song. So, uh, another question was uh, the salsa groove. So salsa, basic salsa groove is usually on a play kick. Go, 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 go. Me, that's how I go. I go around it. So, like, like, uh, like I've just said. Uh, so, uh, that's how I start. And then, uh, my left hand, now is a notes. So, go, go. Slow. Ah, <laughs> it's hard to play and talk. Okay. And then, uh, my right hand, Nacheza. One, two, one, two, continuous. So. Hand. 
Alafu yeah that's that's the basic groove uh, of salsa and nafikirianga when i get to think about this song yeah so but of course na ongeza vitu kiasi kufanya hii sound fit kutoka hizo so ina sound kitu kama so ndacheza i'll play uh, this break this broken down na and then i'll play the full groove uh, the way i played when i play this song okay let's go that's the broken down uh, groove so how i played it it's Those are the few questions. Let me check. Amo amo the drama hizo maswali yes. Uh and the rest of the drum family. Uh those were the questions how to play salsa. Yeah, uh, elaborating uh the groove. How you think around the groove? Yeah. I guess uh answered that. Those are the breakdowns. Okay. Uh there's some people who usually ask how I do uh my kicks so uh around my build up chops uh let me do this gugutaka gugudugo 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 so it has sound easy to make it ah uh, so you can place this anywhere in your drum kit let me mute my phone you can play it anywhere on the hi hats uh Tom's anywhere anywhere yeah ah uh, the uh, okay the basics of chops uh when i when i came to realize that chops aren't hard for african drummers because most of these chops when you go so slow you'll get a groove of an african beat like that's a kenyan kikuyu beat gugutakata 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 gugutaka gugudugu 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 Yeah, there's a there's a groove called Kikuyu groove in Kenya. Yeah, it goes like that. So when when you when you increase your speed on just uh the whatever be, the whatever nini I've, I've shown you, it will sound something like this. Yeah. Uh build up chops. Uh about uh linear chops, rudiments, yeah. As far as you can call them, I'll say uh okay, the tutorials that are already in YouTube, they are so helpful. Uh there is no other way. Yeah, you have to watch them, practice them and be consistent in your practices. that's what makes all the rest of us drummers perfect even you watching so yeah uh yeah let's go with singles and then doubles triplets and then ah uh, for as long as you can go yeah even me i'm still practicing <laughs> so singles so with singles uh, you give space to your other hand to to hit uh before you hit with the same hand you started with so like right left right left left right yeah 
depends on how your mind is set. Uh, okay, my take on uh, whether to play with your left hand or right hand, uh, any groove or chops, me I'll just say, use, use whatever is favorable for you. Yeah, because me I'm a right-handed, I guess most of my notes uh, are based on my, ha- my right hand. So if you're a left-handed and, uh, and your first hand is your left hand, don't limit yourself. Make sure you do practice. Go around the kit. There's a drummer called uh, Zakalfa, Jasiel. Those are left-handed drummers that I really respect here in Kenya. And yeah, I <laughs> listening them play makes me think like, ah, what are these? What are these? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. It looks really interesting seeing someone doing something. Uh, with a different angle, different approach, yeah. Uh, like <laughs> Zakalfa, <laughs> he's, he's a really funny drama. Me see him playing so funnily and very inter- interestingly. So like the way he do chops with my right hand, uh, I see him with, the, with his left hand going in front of the right hand. <laughs> it's so interesting, yeah. Uh, continue practicing. Use your favorable hand. If it's your kick, if your left kick is uh, better than your right kick, go with your left kick. Continue practicing towards where you you are comfortable and towards where you want to grow into in this line of music. Yeah. Uh huh. Yeah. So. I've just done singles. Let me do doubles. Uh, right, right, left, left, right, right, left, left, or left, left, right, right. Yeah, those are doubles. Uh, and make sure your notes. Make sure your notes have the same velocity and same strength. Because uh, it's a clash uh, that uh, some of your notes are louder than your other notes. Yeah, this uh, these are in linear chops and rudiment uh, rudiment chops. Uh, there, are, there are people who asked how drummers dribble. So dribbling. Uh, let me use this this camera because it's near me dribbling you, you do yeah you loosen your hands uh there are people who 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 do like this and there are people who go like me <laughs> so slower you do And then you connect the two. Uh, so, ukiambiwa play a drum roll. Uh, you can dribble. Uh, instead of using your strength and doing... Uh, yeah, dribbling is easier and better. Uh, doing drum rolls and... Yeah, those kind of dribbling stuff. Like Triplets, one, two, three, one, two, three. Even me, I'm doing practice as I'm teaching you. So, how to apply these linear chops? I'll teach you this chop. Uh, 
uh, it will help you to know how to chop around your drum kit. So it goes like, and then you you uh, you put your kick at the last note. So it sounds like This is my metronome. strength as your right hand so uh if you're a left-handed drummer you can try if it's easier for you to do uh left on top of right yeah just the same thing Le- okay you'll do left right right left right left right r- left right so uh, you can still do that so slower That's how it's supposed to sound. And then let's let's include a, a, a crash roll. Uh, for the left-handed. Uh, slower. Let's include a crash for the left-handed drummers. Yeah, so let me put a groove. switch up. Yeah, I'm not a left-handed drama. I'm trying to teach you guys. So, unezo ongeza length yake. So, unezo ongeza pia kicks. You can add like double kicks. So, you can do uh, and then you start with the kick. You can start with a uh, single kick or double kick like uh, double kick uh, so depends on your speed you can work on this yeah let me let me continue with this and then we take a track alafu i'll put a track and play that groove and we tie it all yeah and then we call it a wrap for this tutorial dante chops one two
Yeah, that's how you apply. Yeah, going around the drum kit. Yeah. So, I'm playing this music from my phone. <laughs> 